Happy New Year everybody. Uh, this is just a, a preview of some things I've been working on. Uh, this year for Christmas one of the things I got was a ton of mind sensor stuff and a uh, big fan of what they do. And so I wanted to share one of the things uh, the mind sensor offer, uh, which is the RCX multiplexer. So this allows you to run four motors off a sensor port on your NXT. Does require an external battery pack, which I've got just there, but it is really, really easy to use thanks to Xander's um, driver suite. I'm not sure if he actually wrote the driver for that particular one. However, um, it is in contained in there and it is an absolute brilliant thing to use. Um, this is the actual body it's in at the moment is Wheeler's um, prototype body. It's a bit simple and it's a bit crude. Um, it goes on the end of these wheels, which I hope to show soon. I've just got some problems with the weight at the moment and the wheels turning. Um, so, yeah. This, the main reason I built this is to build it out of something that wasn't black and so I've used old grey for the head and the frame for the wheels and, and red so they're all nice and... So anyway, I wasn't trying to show you that, I'm trying to show you what I think of the uh, uh, RCX multiplexer. One of the things I all, am also going to show you is here I have a Dell Street one and Android 2.2 um, doesn't come into focus very well sadly um, this code is based off the NXT Remote project, which is an open source project um, that allows you to directly uh, control free, the, the free motor ports on an NXT. However, uh, these use direct commands, they're called. Uh, Lego have direct commands and messages, uh, or non-direct commands. And so the project I've been working on, which I hope to make open source on my blog, is um, it allows you to send messages uh, to your, your uh, programming. So I use Robot C on the NXT and um, the way I've written it, it directly uses message params and so it sends information to message params and so you can control your uh, your device and all the multiplexes or any motors or sensors you want to via your Android device. As I said, it hopefully will be on my blog soon at birth.org.uk but uh, I just need to make sure I update the licensing and everything like that. Uh, so that I respect the NXT Remotes project. I don't really care what people do in my code. So, anyway, just to demonstrate this, so we have dun 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 dun, dun these eight buttons here. So the first one's move the head. Yay! The second set of buttons moves the arm up and down. Whee! Sorry for the sound effects. It's New Year's Day, what can you expect? And there's the other arm moving up and down. And then I've used the final motor port on the uh, RCX multiplexer to open and close the claws. Mm -hmm. So they both run off the same uh, claws and they're just uh, quite little simple things I worked on. They've got micro motors in there, little red ones, don't see them very often. And so, yes, um, so kind of uh, thoughts on this. I I'm really impressed with the uh, RCX multiplexer. I actually paid for this. I don't think I'm sponsored or, you know, got it sent through the post and I'd be biased. Um, uh, I really like it because it doesn't use one of your main motor ports, which allows you to so have an extra four motors. A normal NXT multiplexer allows you to add two, but I believe that runs off motor port. I could be wrong. Um, and this goes on your sensor port, and so you use another four motors to your normal NXT. And you could then have four of these, so 16 motors. And most people that have been into LEGO for a while will have the old style motors. The grey ones there. Not as powerful as the NXT motors or power functions, but with enough gear in, they can work. Um, so um, it's pity that uh, there isn't a way of somehow linking the battery pack. Uh, so it doesn't use the ba external battery pack, it actually uses the NXT battery pack because I've got a rechargeable one in there. But you can't have everything in life, can you really? So anyway, that was my route, as I hope everybody has a happy New Year's uh, New Year, and speak to you soon. Bye!